Hi, myself, Dr. Satish Kumar Anandan, surgical oncologist and health expert. Let me share another incident which recently happened. A 19 to 20 year old female presented to OPD with a 3 to 4 centimeter lump in the thyroid gland. So which is very obvious from outside. So the parents looked apprehensive. I told, let me see all the reports and then we can come to a conclusion. So they handed me your booklet of investigations. I asked them, provide me these three investigations which is required for thyroid assessment. Number one, imaging in the form of ultrasound or CT scan. Number two, thyroid function test. Number three, FNAC. After seeing the reports, I told them, your FNA shows Bethesda 3. They asked me, what is it doctor, is it cancer? I said, well exactly not. In thyroid tumors, we have a classification called Bethesda. It ranges from 1 to 6. 1 or 2 means normal, 6 means cancer. 3 stands somewhere in between, in which we are not very sure whether it's normal or abnormal. The patient attendants become more confused and ask me, what to do now doctor? I told them, don't get confused, relax first. Number 1, the risk of malignancy in Bethesda 3 is only 10 to 15 percentages. We have multiple treatment options for Bethesda 3. First of all, we'll go for repeated FNAC. We'll see what clarity it shows to us. Even if the repeat FNAC shows Bethesda 3, we have two options. Either go for surveillance where we see the patient regularly after 3 to 6 months to see whether the tumor grows or not. And the second option is straight away go for surgery and clear all the doubts. After understanding this Bethesda 3, the patient and attendants got convinced. Bethesda 3 is a tricky situation for both patients as well as surgeons. If any of your patient got Bethesda 3 in thyroid lump, this video might help them. Thank you.